out here with Gus. Broke his white diamond back. Uh, getting the rest of the walnuts off the tree. They've been, uh, they've been steadily coming. But this is his uh, wild activities we do. Flirt. He likes to flirt. He likes the uh, mill. But this is by far his favorite thing to do. And we're not one to let our dogs hang off the ground. Twirl. Um, we, we feel like we get better benefit four feet on the ground and, and uh, let them tug and pull and work in the, the back, the front, the whole deal. But this is his first work in a while. He's been, uh, he was in a kennel, then back on the chain, a little bit out of shape. Uh, we were pulling vials off him, but uh, that one was close. I saw the shadow coming. But he, uh, they've shut down the vet since August. And uh, I called, they're not opening up till after the first of the year for any reproductive services, which is kind of a crock of shit, to be honest with you. We've got vials. We had a dog come in the heat and couldn't get her bread because they were shut down, lack of staff due to COVID. And the, uh, the, the, Repo assistant <clears throat> quit, left for a different job. They can't hire anybody to fill that position. But that's not, we feel like that's not our responsibility, but we suffer the consequences for it. So, but I just wanted to get a little video. So you see that they're not just always on the chain. You get a little exercise. Um, hard for us to justify working dogs at this point in time, but we're going to get them just a little bit. And uh, you know, figure out who we're going to take to Florida. I'll. I'll take a, a dog or two that's a butterfly or something. You know, and uh, we've all heard the stories about Honey Bunch's demise. That's one of the reasons we like to keep all floors on the ground. You know, because they uh, jumping after it and Breaking their back is not uh, not going to be a good day here. This is uh, our son of Stonewall. For the pet junkies, he's Stonewall was put into Rosalani, who was a granddaughter of Desert Rat Champion Doc Holliday through uh, Desert Rats, Hickson, and Rocco's Lolita, just passed a little bit ago. Um, Hickson died in Alabama in a yard accident down there, from what I'm told, and uh, Get it? Good boy. Come on. He's going after them. Good boy. Get it. Yeah. The, uh... But a vial of, off a of stone wall was put into Lolita, or I mean Rosalani. And, uh... This is one of the living sons off a of stone wall. 
only a few out there. They're getting up, up in age. You know, middle-aged, I should say. He's coming up on six. Birthday's in May. Heck, he might be six coming up on seven. I'll have to look. But fortunate to, to have this dog, to own this dog. You know, honey bunch times two in his third gen. Off the half brother, half sister breeding of. Uh, Grand Champion Snake to Champion Missy. Huh. What you doing? Get it? Yeah. This has been his for, like I said, his first exercise in a while, other than running that chain. Just because we were planning on getting more vials out of him. Good boy.